Well, sorry, it's been a while since I did any videos or any updates, but today is sanding day. Should have been a couple days ago, but I was just lazy. Not really getting out of here doing much. We're going to try to race this weekend. Don't know if that'll work out or not. Um, I'm still trying to race out of this thing, the toy hauler, and the more I organize, the more I just realize it's just too cramped in there. Um, but I'm going to push through like I'm going to race. We got to get the go kart out and get the body on it and get Luca back on the scales and see if he's see how much off it is between Luca and Daniel. I think all we got to do is pull some weight off in, in certain areas and it'll be good. So what I'm going to do is take these tires on the ground. I got three sets here that I'm going to sand. Um, and it, two of them are the ones you've been seeing in the videos. One of them is the set that I'd already ran up at Rebel Speedway that I'm going to sand and they'll have to be flipped. But I can't find my left rear, so I don't know where. <laughs> it might be in Joey's trailer. But um, I'm going to have to sand those and flip those and uh, get those ready to be raced too because they've got a lot of prep in them. Uh, they got super soft on us, so I'll probably end up trying to run those in practice with no prep and just see if they'll we can burn the prep out of them and see how fast they are. They might actually be the fastest since they're already prepped. Got more prep in them than all the other ones I have. But got my lovely little tire sanding apron on. Here, uh, let me turn you around and we'll talk about the sander, the poor sander. It's time for a rebuild. So this is a sander I built a year and a half ago, two years ago, right after we started. It's way too big. The table and everything, it's just ridiculous. And then the kids left it out in the rain. So I did plug it up and it still works, but it's starting to rust. It needs to be torn apart and cleaned. Um, it's just the typical sander, bent axle, uh, pulley, pulley adapter that I welded to it from uh, Agri Supply, and then the motor. I think Chad, it motor came from Chad, and then this is a Harbor Freight table. I went in and be like, oh, let me buy, let me buy this. This will work. And then when I got home, put it together, I was like, man, this thing is huge. It's like too big to be doing anything with as a tire sander and try to take it with you to a track. But also. Uh, We'd set a go-kart on the floor, thought we had it strapped down. We were young and dumb, I guess, and we left the tires on it, and it come loose and took out the stand, so it bent three of the legs, and they're barely holding on down there. I want to change it to the smaller stand that you see everybody use to build tire sanders, and uh, that way it's less room in the trailer if you do decide to take it to the track. But uh, that's it. I'm going to... Get out of here.